Okay, hello everyone, Bridget Ayer again. I'm here to give you five tips for um, gift ideas for your mom. I realize Mother's Day is right around the corner. I am a radio host on Catholic Radio Indy. I host a show called Faith in Action. And in the past couple uh, weeks and months, and even today, I have had some really interesting guests, and I would like to share with you a couple um, of the ideas I have, which I thought would make great Mother's Day gifts. The first book that I have, I interviewed a woman today. Her name is Barbara Lee. She is a author and a speaker, and she gives retreats on the topic of spiritual direction. Her book is called God Isn't Finished With Me Yet, Discovering the Spiritual Graces of Later Life. So she had a, um, a calling in later life to serve older um, adults. So it's really um, an interesting concept and it's something that she's doing and it's a really interesting book. So I would encourage you to get that and you can get that on Amazon. It's called God Isn't Finished With Me Yet, Discovering the Spiritual Graces of Later Life. And actually that concept can really be um, applied in a sense to everyone because you might be done with a certain phase of your life. You may not be very old, but sometimes when you finish one phase of your life, you think, oh, well, I'm done. Well, not necessarily. So that's kind of the point of her book. So that's the first idea. And that's actually, spoiler mom, that's what you're getting for Mother's Day because I think you'll really enjoy it. Um, okay, the second item. The second item is called Orderly Days. This is by uh, actually a friend of mine. Her name is Kate Conway. She came up with this idea, Orderly Days. It's a day planner. Take a look at this really neat scripture back here. Orderly Days is a day planner and it's great for moms. <clears throat> it includes something that's really important, meal planning shopping list your weekly plan right there this is what every mom needs the master to-do list right and the other thing that I really liked about this was um, self-care which is really important if you're a mom you can't take care of other people if you're not taking care of yourself and <clears throat> comes in this really cute pouch it's um, available at motherhoodpress.org and they have so many, she's got a lot of really cute um, merchandise there. The other thing I like about Orderly Days is this portable hole punch. I always, seems like I have other papers that I might want to stick in my day planner. Even though I have a digital calendar, I still um, carry um, a day planner and this is great because it fits in your purse it's really um, the whole thing's portable but it's nice to have this hole punch too that you can add things to that okay the third thing is a book called joy powered family uh, this is by Jody Curtis and Denise McGonigal they are uh, awesome holy women and they um, put this book together. It's stories of um, different families and um, it gives you some ideas of how to have your own joy powered family. So that's a really great book. In fact, um, all of these people that, um, these things that I'm suggesting, I have interviewed these people and um, I will put the links to the podcasts of all these interviews. So if you want more information about these authors. Uh, you can hear their personal stories. I will be adding those to um, the link. Um, okay, uh, Emily Wilson. This is, she is a YouTube personality. She is a author, an author, and a speaker. And she is actually coming to town. April, not April, we're in May. May 18th at St. Maria Goretti. If you live in the Indianapolis metro area, you can come see her. It's um, 
She's the keynote speaker at a mother-daughter brunch coming up May 18th at St. Maria Goretti. Um, and I'll put the link to register for that if you're interested. But that would be a great thing to go um, take your mom or if you're a mom watching this, maybe you can take your daughter. So being uh, one great thing about um, doing an event like this is it's an event that you can take your mom, it's an event you can go with your daughters, and it's kind of a gift to the mom, even if she buys the ticket and goes with her daughters just to spend time with her, her daughters. I'm taking my two girls, so I'm really looking forward to that event. And Emily Wilson also has a new book, and this is also part of the same topic, uh, called Go Bravely. And that book offers 20 tips for young women uh, to uh, live boldly and bravely in this culture being an authentic Catholic woman. So that is, um, I do not have that book, but I'm looking forward to getting that. But that would make a great gift. And then the other book that I think is, a really, is really worth getting, and I actually have and, and read, is It's Okay to Start With You. And that book is about self-care. It's by Julie Marie Hogan. She is a therapist based out of Chicago, the Chicago area. And the concept of the book is self-care is not about, you know, going to a spa once a month or every once in a while, some random splurge. It's more about being intentional in taking care of yourself and the book helps you figure out what your needs are because if you're not taking care of yourself and every mother knows this then you can't really take care of anybody else you can't um, do what God is calling you to do and um, it, it it really helps you be the best version of yourself so that you can do um, the work that God's calling you to. So that's kind of the premise of that book, so I would highly recommend that. And then the, the last thing I want you to um, consider giving to your mom is <clears throat> Catholic socks. This is just the coolest <laughs> thing. It's just exactly what it sounds like, Catholic socks. Um, I interviewed the... Um, the founder or co-founder of the company uh, Catholic Socks, uh, Scott Williams, and I will give the link to Catholic Socks. Basically, they're socks with various Catholic saints, and they're just so cool and so cute, and they're good for all ages, but I think your mom might like that. So these are some of the things that have come across my desk in the past couple weeks and months that I wanted to share with you, and I hope you will consider one of these items as a awesome gift for your awesome mom. Take care. Bye.